Hey everybody, Tom Bullington here, Kelly Williams Realty. It is Sunday, February 9th, 2020. Hope all of you are doing well and you've shoveled out of the uh, seven or eight inches of snow I think we got last night and over the course of the morning. Uh, as, as I sit here, it's about uh, almost four o'clock here on Sunday afternoon and uh, the sun is out. It looks like some of the road is uh, drying off or is at least melting, which is great, <laughs> which is great to see. Hey, um, the most important room in your house, especially when you're looking for a home, if you're in the market for a new home, um, which, which room do you think it is? Well, it's the kitchen. And the reason why it's the kitchen is, I think this has been a cultural phenomenon for generations. Uh, the kitchen is really the place where your family has been, um, it has grown up, right? So it's, it's the meals, it's the conversations around the kitchen table, it's the preparing the food, it's eating, <laughs> obviously, uh, welcoming family, welcoming friends into your, into your home. The kitchen is traditionally where that takes place. A lot of conversations, a lot of big decisions happen around the kitchen table and around the, um, around the kitchen. So definitely I would say the kitchen wins the prize as far as being the most important room in the home. So that being said, either when you're looking for a home or when you're selling a home, you want to make sure that the kitchen is uh, paramount, that you're going to be spending probably most of your time in the home, um, in the kitchen. Of course, with the open concept now that we have uh, in newer homes, the kitchen is increasingly important because it's attached to the living room. It's attached to where the television is, not only for eating purposes, but for conversation purposes, for watching a, watching a game or watching something on the news or uh, American Idol or whatever you might be watching. Um, the kitchen is usually where you're going to be um, having those conversations, having that entertainment happening. So as you're going into a home, I think just make sure that you are looking at it from a perspective of, um, is this going to be comfortable? Is it going to be a room I'd like to spend a lot of time in? Um, are the, is there enough, uh, cabinets, uh, you know, the cabinets, the right colors for you? Is there enough storage space? Um, is there enough space on the counters for preparing food? Is there an island for preparing food for additional storage? Lots of questions like this. Look at the appliances. If you are into gas or electric um, appliances, making sure that you have those selected as well. Some folks will not even enter a home that doesn't have the gas, uh, a gas stove. So, um, making sure that if you don't have a gas stove in your uh, prospective home, uh, seeing if you can actually get gas hooked up in there. Gas just tends to be the most popular, uh, at least right now in 2020, uh, stainless steel appliances tend to be the most popular. That may change in the next two to five years. Who knows? We may just say, no, we want all whatever it is, all colors, different colors, colors of the rainbow on my uh, appliances. But for now, stainless steel, uh, hardwood floors, obviously the biggest, one of the biggest attractions, and uh, lots of cabinet storage space, counter space for prep, things like that. So, um, so definitely, whether you're buying or selling, make sure your kitchen is where you want to be. If you're selling your home, make sure it's up to date. It's up to snuff. People are looking at these things very carefully because we know they're going to be spending most of their time in the kitchen. If you have any other questions about kitchens or uh, just looking at homes and, and how that whole process works, please feel free to give me a call. I'm at 651-402-6356. I'd love to have you visit my website at buysouthmetro.com. Uh, or just give me a call, 651-402-6356. Again, Tom Bullington, Keller Williams, and we'll talk soon. Thanks. Bye.